Oo na! With Oscar Oida. Magandang gabi mga kausap. Oras naman para sa Oo na. Title pa lang ng show. Nakaka-fit vibes. Yes! Isang oras na kwelang kwentuhan at kaalaman. Huwag yun ako masyadong intindihin ang mga nawala dahil ang mga... Napaka-oo lang, tsumamba lang. Usapang anything under the mood. MG Marfori! Pogi, Pogi! <laughs> Mas guwapo ka, bro. Isa lang ang sagot namin dyan. Ano? Oh, na! Hindi pa mas maganda si MJ? Siyempre! Siyempre! Ako ba tumukan ako dito? Na, pero may baon ka ba? Sa aming joke or kanta? Hindi. Sabi niya ako nag-prepare. Surprise! Say na rin na rin kiss me Kahit anong aking No, you, you look great gabi, at gabi. all now. Sa kanyang FB page. Ito na siya, mga kausap. I can feel it. Love you. Oo na, with Oscar Oida. Okay, magandang magandang gabi mga kaosap Oras na naman para sa OO na isang oras na kwentuhan, kulitan At mga kung ano mga bagay, pampa good vibes no? Para medyo makalimutan natin yung mga stress natin sa araw-araw Kamusta po ang araw nyo ngayon? Maganda ba? Kamusta ang update natin? Marami mga nadali, sana hindi no? At balita ko parang kukunti o wala ngayong araw And that's That's good news, no? Pagdasal natin na sana magpatuloy yan, no? Mas marami tayong nakaka-survive dyan sa, sa pandemya, sa sakit ng COVID, no? Magtulong-tulong tayo para hindi dumala ang sitwasyon, no? Hindi magkahawaan yan. At ngayong gabi, special na special. I'm sure yeah. na hindi na kayo, no? Kung sino ang uh, makasama natin na uh, ngayong gabi dahil, dahil, no? Na, na palabas ko na yan, yung mga teaser, no? Napanood nyo na yan, yung mga poster, nagpalabas na ako. So, I guess, alam nyo na, no? Talagang ang international to no international star to no at matagal na hinangaan at uh, kinasabikan at ngayong gabi maswerte tayo dahil makakasama na natin siya finally kunit no sa mga nakamiss sa kanya eto tawagin na natin no napakaganda napakasexy no nating uh, kaibigan ayan at uh, international star Japanese actress and model tawagin natin handa na ba siya handa na ba Maria? Maria? <laughs> okay, let's call on Maria Ozawa. Yes! Okay, good evening! Ayan, good evening, live from Japan. Ayan, nag-aayos-ayos pa siya, ano? Okay, okay, konbanwa, Maria, konbanwa. Tama ba? Ay, nawala yan. Parang mali yata yung sinabi ko. Sabi ko, konbanwa, tawa, good evening. Is that right, Maria? Okay. There you go. Wow. Uh, Marie Ozawa. I have really trouble hearing you guys. Oh, okay. Can you hear me, Maria? Can you hear me? Maria, can you hear me? Okay, I think she's having a problem with her audio. Um, she's trying to fix it. In, uh, inaayos-ayos lang yung uh, mga kausap, no? At uh, hopefully... Okay, Maria. Okay, inaayos-ayos lang niya, no? For the meantime, yan, no? Naka, na-contact natin si Maria Zawa from Japan to, to my guest coordinator, syempre, si MJ Marfori. At uh, <laughs> thank you, sal salamat, MJ, no? At uh, tinan natin siya. Okay, Maria, can you hear me? Yes, finally. Can sorry, me, sorry, Maria? sorry. Oh. I can hear you finally. Thank you, hey! thank you. <laughs> <laughs> konbanwa, Maria, konbanwa. Kumbang, magandang hapon. Yeah, magandang gabi. Thank you. Hapon. Gabi, okay. gabi. Magandang gabi. Anatawa, utsuko si Des. Anatawa, oh, utsuko si Des. Salamat. <laughs> okay, you're welcome. Ayan. So, how are you, Maria? How are you? We miss you here in the Philippines. Yes, I miss the Philippines so much. I've been stuck in Japan for maybe like around three months right now. Wow, three months. Be before, yes. before, before going to Japan, you were recently here in Manila, yeah. right? Yes, yes. I was in Manila. Um, is the lockdown started around March, right? Mid March. Mm -hmm. Yes, yes. So 
after that, around like first week or second week of April, I flew back to Japan because I had a bar and I was like really worried and my family was very sick about me. So they were like, why don't you just come back to Japan for a month or so? Okay. And I thought I would be able to go back to the Philippines around July, but then, you know, the plane is still like, it's not flying back. I mean, they're not letting in non-residents people yes, in yes. the Philippines. Uh, yes. So, so, I'm, so how was it? How What have you been doing lately for this past few months there in Japan? Um, Actually, I have a bar in Tokyo. It's a place called Shinjuku area. Oh, have you yeah. heard of it? Yes, we've been there. Yeah. Uh, I come in the MJ John. Yeah, so mm -hmm. it's a really good place to party, you know, Shinjuku. Go, oh, do you, yes. Do allow you to party at this time? There's pandemic? Uh, um, Actually, the only the clubs are not allowed, of course, oh, but okay. the bars, like bars and restaurants and like shopping malls and the uh, those places are slowly but mm -hmm. surely coming back. So how, how do you mean of course you shall you have to maintain social distancing right so how do you do that yeah. in your bar in uh, Shinjuku you are there right now uh, right yeah well, I this is my bar okay. well, you can see only wow. the wall but um later yeah. I'll give you a tour wow that'll be nice wow we tour it is a bar in Maria boy sweating sweating Maria go ahead so so how what what practices do you do to ensure your the safety of your um, clients your <laughs> Customers. Actually, when this is not only for my bar, but all the bars that we have here in mm -hmm. Japan, Tokyo right now, it's like when a customer or a guest comes in the bar, we have this alcohol and then you spray it to their clothes, their hands. Mm -hmm. And they, yeah, there's a special spray that you can buy in Don Quixote in Japan. So oh. you can actually buy anything there. And you can oh, get I, like yeah. those okay. spray. Yes, I'm familiar that MJ is a fan of that store. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yes, you find everything there, okay? So so you 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 get us an alcohol there that you can spray in your clothes, no? Not yes, only your, hand, your but clothes. Your yeah, your clothes, your hands, and some people and they're like, you know, their hair also the girls, you know, if they want to. So we have this bottle, three bottles, two liter bottles in our bar all the time. Okay, the, so how do you so, yeah. How do you make? How do you ensure the the social distancing? Do do you have to to stay apart at least um, a meter? Do you have that rule there? So, the thing is, my bar is a little bit small, so we have like one counter and one table, which I'm sitting down right now. So when it's like oh. early time, like right now, maybe like nine until midnight, the customers are really like kind of slow, slow night. So okay. we have like one. We I I ask them to sit. Like one seat and then blank, one seat, blank, one seat, blank. Okay, and have like a space be between them. At least a meter away from each other, right? Yeah, yeah, yes, yeah. But then sometimes it's like a Friday night, Saturday night, and then the place is packed. You know, you can't do anything about it. They, they just like come back later when it's like after midnight. Because we have our bar until 3 a.m. Oh, do they wear masks? Do you wear masks in Japan? Oh, yeah. Well, actually, way before this pandemic, the exactly. corona thing, Jap Japanese people are known to wear yeah. masks all the time. Maybe that's why. So maybe we are, that's why, that's why you maybe were that's one of the reasons. way ahead prepared compared to others because you are so used to already wearing masks. Maybe that is so. Yes, yes. It's our, it's our like daily thing to wear masks every day. So it's nothing new to us. So we're like, when the, when the prime minister is like, don't, you have to wear a mask everywhere you go. We're like, we've been doing that since birth, right? You know, so it's nothing oh. new. <laughs> yes, okay. <laughs> uh, before, before anything else, uh, Maria, let's let's uh, let's we let's uh, try to say hi to our viewers right now. Uh, there are many people, okay. people, you know, people watching us. Uh, uh, we'll we'll greet them one by one, like like MJ Marfor, okay. my wife, Ryan Lim, Wow Small World. Oh, Ryan Lim is here. He's our friend. He's a good friend, and he's in Japan. Yeah. Also. It's a Ryan Lim. Yeah. Yeah. Kapit bahay ko yan siya dito sa Shinjuku. Yeah, he's a neighbor. Oh, wow. Yeah. wow. That's very yeah. nice. So we have we have Maria and uh, and Ryan from Japan. Good evening to all of you who's watching us. 
Okay, RD Simpson, magre-review lang ako, sabi. Hello! <laughs> okay. Here's a good friend from Sydney, Australia. Hola, Maria. Oh. Did you spend some time in Canada growing up? Two parles. Oh, Frans wow! Tama ba, yung, tama ba yung translation ko? <laughs> okay, so so yeah, you did, right? You 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 have a Canadian mm -hmm. blood, right? Did you you grew up yes, in Canada? Yes, I'm half Canadian. Yes, okay. Yes, actually, my father is Canadian, so I would go back and forth, like spend some time at my um, dad's family, and then come back to Japan and go back and forth. Okay, Ryan, a, a yeah. follow-up question: How special was the movie Invitation Only? It's Taiwan's oh, first theater wow. movie, and apparently your first mainstream flick, according to Ryan. Yes, yes. Yes. That's like my um. That was like my debut action thriller movie that I did before. Yes. It so, was like a Taiwanese movie. Yeah. And oh, you've and been I, to a, it, it was like to a lot of uh of uh, movies, huh? uh, all over the world, nah. Yeah. Not only yes, Japan, yes, yes, yes. Taiwan, Philippines. Where else? In America, I'm sure. China, China, China. China. Yeah. So yeah, and dami no, medyo nino nose bleed na tayo. <laughs> pero pero I I asked uh, Maria a while ago, you can still uh, understand a little Tagalog, right? Naiintindihan mo pa konti? Very good, very good. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> Ay, at least hindi tayo masyado man nose bleed, medyo nagagamit na natin yung mga ipo nating English eh. <laughs> oh, ito. Ryan, that's another uh, follow-up question, no? Ang daming hinandang question ni Ni Ryan, can you tell us more about your name, Miyabi? Oh, I remember. That's your name. Oh, Miyabi. Actually, okay. this is like really, I really don't know myself. But before <laughs> when I debuted in the industry, people okay. just started to call me Miyabi for some reason. Oh. It was like my, it was like my nickname. It was like my nickname. Indonesian people started it. They called me Miyabi. But that's not really your name. So, no, Maria, Maria. So every Maria. time I go to Indonesia, Bali, or wherever, China, I'll be like, hi, Maria Ozawa. They're all like, Miyabi, Miyabi. Yeah. And I'm like, that's not my name. So Miyabi, what is the meaning of Miyabi? Uh, it's also a Japanese word, right? Well, it it shows like it's one of the, um, how do you say this? Like the beautiful side of Japan. Like you, oh. you say, there's a saying. When you use that name, it's like beautiful, pure, like Japanese. Oh, maybe like that. that is why they call you Miyabi. Maybe, maybe, maybe. maybe. You're so beautiful. That's why. Thank you. Uh, okay. <laughs> okay, next message from MJ Marfori. Konnichiwa, Maria. That's my <laughs> Hi, MJ. MJ. I yeah. miss you. Okay. And um, Rialave uh, Real Vigil. Vigil. Sir Roman po undi Ramon. Sir Roman po undi Ramon. Okay. Hindi ko naiintindihan. <laughs> okay. Eh. So Ryan, oh Ryan, question again. Um, soba or ramen? Um, I'll definitely go for ramen. I love ramen. Hmm. Why? Why ramen? It's just that I've, I've grown up eating ramen every time. My mom makes the best ramen at home. We could go outside and eat ramen. We have lots of cup noodle in the convenience store. Yeah. There's always ramen around the corner in Japan. So I'm more of a noodle person than a rice person. And you know, your convenience store in Japan is so good. I can survive. I can survive the country for a mm. month just eating yeah. inside the convenience store. You know, you have yeah. plenty of choices. It's like a restaurant. Yes, it's like a restaurant. Yeah. Yeah, that's all right. Okay, from June Biritero de Catoria, he's a regular viewers of our viewer of ours. Um, uh, Maria, good evening, Oscar from Ian, Austria. Hi, Miss Maria Ozawa. Good evening. Hello. When will you come back to Philippines show bispo? How you're oh. how you're safe there? How are you there? Are you safe in Japan? Because I know there are heavy rains there. For God bless. Oh, right uh. now, there, right? Right now, it's our rainy season. After this, from June, end of June, it's our summertime until end of August. Okay. So so the weather right now, how's the weather right now? It's raining, right? Rainy season. It's raining yeah. every day. It's like monsoon. Oh, thank God. It's not affecting your internet connection right now. We're, we're doing I good. I know. 
so far. I'm so scared. It might like cancel. No, I mean, I have faith. You have Japanese internet connection. <laughs> that's good. That's good. So I guess that's a very good internet connection. <laughs> okay. Okay, from June Biritero de Catoria, again, I watch your report first before I proceed here, Oscar. Oh, thank you very much, June. Thank you so much. From Arvin, good evening, Boss Oscar and Miss Maria. Hello. Sabi, sabi ni June, moshi, moshi, Maria. <laughs> moshi, yeah. moshi, hello. Everybody's like, Japanese people, are like, when they get their phone, they're like, mos, mos. That's mos, our mos. stuff. Okay. <laughs> Okay, from Stella, kaya biyab, good PM. Oo, kamusta? Nawala ako ilang days. Namiss ko kayo. Oo, namiss ka rin namin, Stella. Welcome back. Thank you for joining us. From MJ Marfori, we were supposed to go to your bar in Shinjuku last year, but ah? it was closed. Yes. Oh, yeah! yeah! September time. We were supposed to go there. Yes. I, I remember. Mm. Next uh, time. Next time. Next time. Next time. Yeah, you were, suppo you were supposed to give us a tour around, right? Maybe tonight. Yes, you, yes, yes, yes. You'll show yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, I'll tell Ryan. the guests to cover their face. Oh, yes. <laughs> from Ryan Lim, Konbanwa, Oscar. Oh, good evening, Ryan, MJ, and to guest Maria from the land of the rising sun, Japan. Yes. Wow, thank you. What a yeah. Ryan Lim is your neighbor there. He's a friend. Mm. Okay. Yeah, Ryan Lin Konichiwa, and then din si Maria now. Yeah. Tas, uh, yeah. What are you doing at the present? Okay. And qu question from June. Right now, well, like I told before, I have the <laughs> bar in Shinjuku. So I'm here almost every night. So that's what's and... keeping you close to your bar. Yeah. Yes, yes. At least I have something to do here in Japan. Because if I go mm -hmm. back to the Philippines, our bar is not going to be operating until September. It's, oh. Nah. Okay. At least you're. At least so, you, you have something to do. You know, you're, you're busy. Yeah. No, at that, least, that's, at that's least, important. at least, I can work here. Yes, that's very important. Okay. Yeah. Um, you know, uh, we are very familiar with you. you know, uh, a lot of people worldwide are very familiar with you. you know, because of your because of your career. You no, know? your 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 show mm. business. You no, know? you've been uh, very well mm -hmm. known with your adult films, adult films from way yeah, back. Before. Right? So I'm just yeah. curious. How did you end up in that kind of um, show business, that kind of career? How like did you? How I started it, it before. How did you start? Yes, yes. Like how I started. Um. So yeah. actually, when I, like when I was like graduating, when okay, I was like, okay, sorry, sorry. When I was like graduating <laughs> from high school. Again, um. Actually, when I was like um graduating from high school my only option was like to stay in japan and work or go back to canada and go to mm -hmm. university and i did not want to go to university so i've been working in japan since like i was like 16 or 17 like i enjoyed working like i like to like pay my own bills be responsible oh. independent yeah. so i told my parents i'm gonna stay here and i left the house when i was 17 and it's not like we had problems as a family but i just wanted to be independent on my own so I got my own apartment and I was like thinking what to do. And then my parents were like, why don't you do a model? But then in Japan, it's kind of like, you know, it's like you do a model and you get famous or you become a model and then you get ranked down to porn. So I was like, if people are going to look you down when you're doing modeling and showbiz, why don't I start from the below and then just rise my career up? So it's your own decision. Like, do you know what I'm trying to say? Yeah, yeah. it was my own it's, decision. It's your decision. You were you were not forced. You were not tricked to doing no. things that you didn't like. So, so did you enjoy the job? Well, no, but <laughs> it, it gave me it gave me lots of opportunities. It okay. made me see so many people, and then it made me have like a different point of view because I always like before I went to the industry. Of course, everybody's like had like a major like bad image of the industry right but when you actually become one they're really like everybody's polite the business like the way they think about business is like really professional and it was like it was really good experience that i had Ooh. when i was in the younger days and so, then that made me famous so I yeah went, like, worldwide I was, it, yeah, I was yes. able to go to different countries, do events, meet people that I can't meet, like you know those celebrities and 
I don't know if you're aware about Sorry. this, uh, Maria, but during the earthquake, the big earthquake, no? <laughs> I heard, I heard. World, are, you, are you familiar with that? The people <gasps> yeah. were like, worried, looking for you. They, the world wanted to know back then that if you were, where you were safe, no? If I'm yes. alive, yeah. Yes. So how, how, how did you feel about it? When you, when you found out that the, that the world are looking for you, the people from all over the parts of the globe are looking for you, worried. Aside from you, like first, for the creator of Mario Brothers. Uh, oh, true. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And you? Because like, I didn't know about that news until like a few years later. And then for some reason, my friend were like, did you know that in the Philippines when you guys had the tsunami, People yeah. were worried about the other people, but mainly they wanted to know if you were alive or not. So I was like, that's crazy. <laughs> yes. But, really but again, but again, but again, I felt the love from the people in the Philippines and all over the world. They were like, I didn't know that I was that famous. So I was like, holy shit. Wow. Everybody knows you me. Know? Wow. I, I have a bike group way back then. When they found out mm -hmm. you're safe, they, they made a bike jersey. With your face on it, really? Yeah, just to bike really? Yes, yes. Should wow. should they should they pay you for that? Wow. <laughs> should they pay you for? That? I'll just copyright. I just want to have a copy of that. Oh, okay. I mean, I'll look for them. That was years ago. Okay. 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 Let's just uh, read some more. No, basa basa lang tayo, okay. Ma Maria. No, some messages from yeah. Stella Kayabiab. Shout out, naman, Miss Maria. To Stella. Hello. Yes. Um, sabi ni Stella, galing mo o o taga Japan naman ang guest mo, right? <laughs> oh, ito na nga, ito na 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 nosebleed na. <laughs> Buti ka mo si Maria, nakakaintindihan ng kahit pa no, no, ng Filipino, mm -hmm. di ba Maria, di ba? Yes, ayos yes, ka, yes, yes. Ayos ka ba Maria? Ayos? Ayos? Ayos. <laughs> okay. <laughs> thank you, thank you. Okay. Sabi ni Sabi ni Daniel de los Reyes, arigato, gozai mas. Sir Oscar and ah. Miss Maria. O. Oh. Oh. Wala naman. Yes, Oscar O meets Maria O. Huh? Diba? Thanks. Ayos, ayos, ayos. Ayos, ayos. Okay. Jun Biretero de Catoria, stay safe there and monitor your health. Wow, talaga makapayo talaga. Thank you very much. Sabi ni Sel Kaya Biab, hello Miss MJ. Yan, sabi niya. Tapos... Okay. Hello. From mm -hmm. uh, from uh, Ram Goose, best ramen place in best Japan. Best ramen place. Ligato. Taekwondo champion to see Ram Goose. Um, best ramen in Japan. I think uh, worldwide the the most popular or the known one is uh, ramen. It, uh, ramen. What is it called? Ichiran. Ichiran ramen. Oh. So, I know you're very That's familiar. That's famous. With Yes, I I know you're very familiar with ramen. Of course, no, it's it's yours, no. But mm -hmm. but when you go out of the country, you go to different uh, Japanese restaurants claiming that they yeah. have authentic ramen, no. How do you how mm -hmm. do you know, no? How do you know if it's authentic? Maybe you you were able to differentiate, it's, no. It's it's all about the broth and the toppings, I think, because the noodle itself, anybody can like you know make a new good ramen. But when it's when it comes to the broth and the toppings of ramen, like for example, when I go to different countries or in the Philippines, also they say it's authentic, but sometimes it's like it's not authentic because you don't like for sushi. Like for us, mm -hmm. we don't put mayonnaise in sushi, but people think California roll is Japanese. So it's like you know those little different different difference. Yes, yeah, so, so you it's find still, it's it's still good. Still good, but you know. It's, it's so good. You know, you can really pick. You can you can really uh, identify. You know, you can by yeah. by yeah. taste if it's authentic or not. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Okay. When when we go there, let's you bring us to that. Yeah, uh, I'll take you. I'll take you to the best ramen, ramen shop in the sushi oh, place. Thank you. Thank. Hari keto. Hari keto. Okay, from June Benetori again, Oscar, you're so amazing upon inviting many guests. Oh, thank you, thank you, Juno. Ang galing kasi ng guest coordinator ko si MJ Murphy. <laughs> Yan, from gorgeous, uh, gorgeous, Gonzaga. Bagay din yung gorgeous sa'yo, Gonzaga. Hi po, sabi niya. 
From June, hi double O, kagabi lang, wala kang online, kailan uuwi ng Pinas si Maria? Oh, when are you going back to the Philippines now, Maria? I hope I can go back on August. But fingers crossed because it all depends on the Philippines because if you don't accept yeah. foreigners, I can't go back. Duterte! <laughs> 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 okay. I'm sure when the, when every, when this pandemic is over, we will be very happy and all, I know, glad to accept you again, Maria. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, from John Gutierrez. Oh, my! Oh, John Gutierrez is a classmate of mine oh from way back high school. During that time. <laughs> wow. During pag- the time. Career. Oh, yes, yes. Your career is, you know, is uh, booming. High Do- up. Blooming, <laughs> blooming. Yes, yes. Okay, from from Jobel Morilao Flor. Hello po. Yan. Hello. Tapos, tapos sab- oh, si, sabi ni John Gutierrez, she is a goddess. Uh, <gasps> see, well, thank you very much. Salamat. Sab- oh, Luisito Antonio Santos. He's a, he's a colleague. He's also a reporter. Kapuso. Bata oh, wow. Pa- Bata pa lang po ako, parehas ko na kayo pinapanood. I don't... <laughs> wow, si Luisito talaga. Bata pa naman tayong lahat, ha. Naintindihan mo ba yun, Maria? Naintindihan? Ayos? Ayos? Yes. <laughs> ayos, ayos. O, naintindihan ka raw niya. Okay, from Cortez Gonzaga. Hello po, Sir Oscar and Maria. Hello. Si, si Jobel Morilao Flor. Pa-shoutout po. Shout out down, Maria, Jubel. Hello, Jubel, Maria Flor. Thank yes. you for watching. Yes. Si Yanki Mate. Konnichiwa, Maria. Yanki Konnichiwa. Mate, Yanki Mate. Yes. Tapos si Andre yes. Dondo. Hi, Maria. Hello. Hi, guys. Everybody's like damning questions. Comments. <laughs> yes. Because they waited for this opportunity to catch you again, Maria. They've been waiting for this opportunity to, to see you again because uh, because we miss you a lot, no? From Cortez Gonzaga, thank you, thank you. may laman po ba yung baso niyo, sir? O, <laughs> meron naman, paubos na nga. Ay, paubos na nga, eh, you know? <laughs> okay. Sabi ni June Biritero de Catoria, I salute you, Oscar, the best researcher and reporter as well. Wow. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Perfect. Oh, yeah. Thank oh, you. Are you open to this question, Maria? How old are you? Do you answer that kind of question? Uh, 34. Oh, see, very young. MJ. No, what no, no. Local insider tips for? What's Maria's local um, insider tips for? The tips here for, yeah. like, what? Food? For local insider tips. I guess for, for I don't know, for... For going there in Japan, what's your what's your oh, what's your tip? Okay. Because how we can um, feel like local, I guess, there in Japan. Well, it's well in Japan. It's so commercialized. Everything like everybody knows about everything in Japan. But then try to go to like places that locals will go. Like try to yeah. avoid like big places like um, Roppongi or like Shinjuku, Shibuya. That's mm-hmm. okay also. But then try going to one of those stations that's not that popular, like Shinbashi and Ueno and those places. Because that, that's where we all hang out, and that's where they have the cheap izakaya, which you can have the best food also. Like, so the expensive places are okay also, but then, you know, those, like, places that have, like, um, local food is, like, those, like, the street food is really good in Japan also. So try to go there, too. Okay. Okay, let's go back to the questions, Maria. No? A, a while ago, we were talking about your your former career in adult films, no? Mm. Um like yeah. you said, sabi niya, mga kausap, um, no regrets. She enjoyed, no? You enjoyed the career. It gave you a lot of yeah. opportunities. You met a lot of people. Mm-hmm. You got really, yeah. really famous no, worldwide. And of course, good yeah. earnings. I assume good earnings, of course, no? Um, mm. uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Would you recommend a, a friend to enter the same career as you? Uh, maybe a younger friend asking you um, for advice? Would you advise well, well, if that friend really had a dream to achieve using the AVs, the AV um, industry, mm-hmm. I wouldn't say no. But then if you're just wanting to do for 
money or something like that, I wouldn't recommend at all because it's going to be in the internet forever. And in a way, it's going to really change your life. And if you really think about it, it's like a big decision in your life. So I would say I won't recommend it. But if you have the dream, the, the, if you're going to use the AV for a step up of your career, then maybe it's okay. But you just can't do these stuff just because for money. Well, as long as I think you can, you can handle the, the situation, right? I mean, yeah. I mean, obviously, you did. If you can handle you it. And if you handle it uh, um, <laughs> correctly. I was just lucky. Right? I was lucky. I was okay. lucky. Yeah. So, so it was, you know, it was really a good experience for you, like what you told us a while ago. Mm. No? Um, so, what made you decide to to end it? To say to say goodbye to the adult film. Um, I started when I was 18 and by the time when I was 23 I was like famous already worldwide so that was like a dream come true so I wanted to before I get like not famous anymore I wanted to career change so people would like talk about saying oh she was in the peak of her career and then she ended in a good way to do something different so my career change was going to other countries like foreign countries doing movies doing radio show guesting mm -hmm. on their like like tv and like that so i just wanted to change something while i still had the name yeah so so if you if, yeah. you, were, if you were to tell us more no, about you yeah um how would you describe yourself i mean what are the, yes what are the things that we don't know about you of course we we have a lot of um, impressions now we have a lot of info if we are to read about you uh, search about mm -hmm. you on Google we will be able to read things about you but what are the mm. things that you think we don't know about you that you can share to us well actually this is what I always get is like people think I'm not as friendly person like they think I'm kind of like the cold-hearted girl like it's maybe it's because <laughs> my, my face is like kind of mataray, mataray. It's like mataray. i always get this like people <laughs> yeah, yeah but then actually i'm really friendly like i love talking with people i like cooking mm -hmm. i like like traveling and stuff like that and people really don't get that part of me they all think like i'm like you know kind of like suck up but i'm not so <laughs> more you know about me you you might know that i'm a friendly person yeah i i, I can see that i mean you're you're very friendly no uh i've met you Thank maybe you. a couple of times and you were really nice um especially Thank to you. empty of course and uh and that's it i mean yes yes you're not you're not only you don't have you don't only have angelic face you also have an angelic heart Thank you. <laughs> nice. wow you know it's a war <laughs> okay uh, it's uh, i think it's uh, about two or three years four years ago when you came to the philippines right mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Years five years ago five years ago okay. five. five years ago five years ago mm -hmm. when you came. why the philippines no? you are so famous you can you can have a career elsewhere in the world why did you choose the philippines um, because I had a friend who was in the Philippines already and mm -hmm. she was like visiting me and my other common friend in Japan with her family and then they were like, did you know that you have like a big fan base in the Philippines? So why don't you try working there? So it was all like just going to Manila for a travel, like just for mm -hmm. fun. But then she hooked me up with like um, different radio station, different magazine and then everything that was like, it was like, the rest is history. Wow. Okay, is this friend yeah, so I was really lucky. right now in the Philippines? Mm. Yes, and a really good friend of ours also. <laughs> I just want to say hi yeah, to Marga. she became my manager. <laughs> oh, yeah. She's a really good friend, Marga. We'll try to invite her also in the show no? mm. uh, next week, maybe. Sana pumayag si Marga. That's good. <laughs> mm. Okay, so, so, you know, I mean... You had you, you you have a career now in the Philippines and before before the pandemic, I mean I think you're you're doing mm. great. No? So far, can you update us on what have you been doing lately here in the Philippines before the before the lockdown? 
Um, actually, I own two bars in Manila. Like one mm -hmm. is in next to Resort World, Manila. It's right in front of T3. And then mm -hmm. other one is same lounge. It's like a business lounge. It's like a gentleman's mm -hmm. club. And one more is located in New World Hotel, Makati, like basement of New World Hotel. I'm done. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so both of them, <laughs> part owner. Okay, so funny you know, So how are, how is it doing now? I mean, we 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 our bars here in the Philippines are closed. So how are you managing? Yes, it? it's closed. Maintaining it, no? You have you have an. Well, actually, I have like. Well, I have like we have I have five other partners and then they're all taking care of it and they're having like meetings almost every day and mm -hmm. talk to each other when we can reopen the lounge and then the club I don't think we can open it just as of now. But mm -hmm. maybe we're trying to do the social distance and then do open like for only one or two guests per night or like you know, it it's gonna be all strictly on reservation and not like people can just come in and like, you know, drink like before. Mm -hmm. So it's yeah. going to be really hard on business, but we're still talking how we can open for people to come and have fun with us. Oh, okay. So so it's going to take yeah. some time, right? I think it's going to take some time. Before. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I think so, I think we could operate maybe September, October. Oh, okay. Here's here's yeah. another message from Kortius Gonzaga. Japanese po ba siya? Kala ko hapo. Joke yan, no? Ayan, sabi ni Melvin Tan. Hi, Miss Maria. Tapos si Hello. How are you? Miss hey, Maria. Good. Well, actually, it's like, um, you know what? There's something I wanted to share. Like, a oh, yes. few days ago, um, mm -hmm. my Instagram account got hacked. Yes, I really, was about to really go through that. Sad. <laughs> yeah, really sad. I'm really so sad. Yeah. sad. Like, I've been doing my Instagram for like maybe the past 10 years, and then somebody just hacked like three days oh. ago and then the instagram account first it was hacked it was changed to a different name and different profile picture but my yeah. picture was still there and then the next day when i woke up the whole um, account was gone and then i was like who the hell will do that like people yeah. are so cruel there i was so shocked i like i really don't get depressed easily or cry but that day i was like crying my eyeballs out i was like all my memories are gone right and then, of course, my Instagram page was like my um, business tool, also with lots yes. of sponsors. So that's right that's now, yeah. it's memories. Oh, how yeah. many, how many years and how many pictures of memories are there? I don't Where know. I have like two thousand plus videos wow. and pictures, and I had like nine hundred plus K followers. Oh, so to to <clears> regain <throat> that, it's like almost boo. It's almost yeah. impossible. But right now the friend who works in the Instagram, Facebook, Philippines is trying to regain my Yes, I, I think I think they can, no? As far as long as you can, you can, uh, you can prove that it's yours. Provide, no? that yeah, that's mine, yeah. For you because you're well known. Um, my concern is when you get back your account, will, will your pictures mm -hmm. still be there? Because no, it, it's all deleted. Oh, that's sad. That's sad. Mm. Yeah. Boo. But at least if I have my account back, that's good. good yeah. News. And your your nine hundred thousand followers back. I hope. I hope. I know. Sayang. Yeah. Yeah. Sayang. Sayang. No. Oh, that's Sa why I've been I've been looking for your pictures. I've been looking for your account, though. But uh, mm -hmm. it can't it's be, it can't be uh, located right now. No. So all the all the other Instagram accounts. Having the same, they're all fake, 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 fake. It's all fake. Oh. Boo. Well, if there's any consolation, yeah. you have, you have, I mean, so it's it's a proof that you have uh, tons of you know admirers, followers trying to be you. Mm. It's fake. It's fake. Yeah. Boo. Okay. Yeah. So yeah, I hope you get it back. I hope you get back your your Instagram. Uh, hopefully, I'm praying. Yeah, it's still fifty chance. And then the. You can can bring back all the pictures. I don't know if that's possible, but I I'm mm -hmm. praying that you get back your your Instagram account soon. Yeah. So somebody's already helping you, right? Somebody's helping you from yes, the yes, yes. They're trying, yeah. They're trying yeah. to regain your Instagram account. Try, yeah. And try, yeah. I hope you can yeah. identify the perpetrator. You know, the one you're yeah. behind it, because it's not. You know, I, I mean, what what do you get out of it? I mean, I mean, if he, he's I going, he's going to earn something out of it. 
Maybe it's gonna. I don't know. Change the People name. People like saying they sell accounts. For what? I mean, they're going to they're going to change the name so they have instant uh, nine hundred thousand followers. No, no, no. What? No. What they do is they hack on people who has lots of followers, and then they sell the followers to people who wants more followers. Oh, right. Oh, so they're just going to, yeah. to change the identity. Oh, yeah. so so maybe next time you you visit your Instagram and all of a sudden you are following this person, <laughs> maybe you mm. know what no? I know. So, medyo vigilant din, no? If you if you notice something uh, fishy, maybe we should you know, help help report, no? Help the uh, our yeah, block media, um pages, yeah. and Instagram para ma identify yeah. yung mga yung mga mm-hmm. wrongdoers, no? Sa yeah. social media. Yeah. yeah. Okay, so yeah, sana mabalik, no, Maria, sana we can have your mm-hmm. yeah, sana, sana. feedback. Okay, let's go back to showbiz, mm-hmm. if you don't mind, no, Wait, Philippine okay. showbiz. Philippine Wait, showbiz. I, have, I have to go in a bit, though. Okay, okay, so, okay. Um, last question, Um, do you have any, okay. any, any Filipino celebrity crush? Uh, my boyfriend. <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh <laughs> my God. <laughs> Ayan na, oo nga pala. Oo nga naman. <laughs> De, we'll go back, we'll go to to your boyfriend. Pero, pero, do you, do you have aside, any... Aside from Jose, I think yes. um, Coco Martin's really cute. Oh, Coco Martin. I like that baby face. Yes, yes, yes. So, okay, yeah. let's go to Jose, no? Let's go to Jose. How did you, how did you meet? Okay. Um, What, uh, what made you fall um, in love with Jose? Actually, he owns a bar in BF Paranaque. So my mm-hmm. friend, her husband was a childhood friend with him. A childhood friend or like uh, the village friend with him. So they were like, okay. when I first met them, they're like, I, I don't really go out that much because it's a hassle. So they're like, why don't we just go to my friend's bar? And that's where they took me to, Jose's bar. And then that's how I met him. At first, we were just like drinking friends. And we were like, no, go have dinner and then so on. And then... We started dating. And that's it. And what, what are the traits? What are Jose, Jose's traits that you 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 end up really loving, liking? Um, well, he's really, really nice. I mean, like, it's. I think it's the culture. In Japan, we don't mm-hmm. really, like, you know, hug and kiss and say, I love you and stuff like that. But then oh, in the Philippines, really? people are like, especially yes. him, he's good at yes. loving. Yes. So I was like, oh, yes. he's so sweet. Yes, we're very malambing, no? So, we're very expressive. Malambing, so, yeah. Very cute. Very cute. So, ayan, no? Yeah. So, uh, how long have you been together? Five years? Five years? Uh, no, three and a half. Three and a half. Tagal na rin, no? And you, yeah. Parang yeah, pwede, tagal na. Parang pwede na kayong mag... Parang pwede na kayong mag-ozawa. <laughs> <laughs> Ang tagal na rin, eh. Pwede na kayong mag-ozawa. <laughs> Are you are you are you open to that um, idea anytime soon? Are you open to marriage? Do you plan to um, well, be married to you? Maybe not right now because I want to concentrate on my business, but mm-hmm. I hope so soon. Yes. Okay. That's that's really yeah. nice. So we're looking forward to that, and uh, and we wish yeah. you well, Maria. I mean, um, in Thank everything, you your career, so your much. business. Mm. I hope you get your mm-hmm. Instagram account back, no? And we will be praying yes. for you. MJ and I will be praying for you. And we hope to see you soon, Thank no? You. Uh, when yes, when yes, everything yes. is over, the pandemic is over, please come back and visit the Philippines. Yes. Again, no? We'll be very happy for to sure. see you. Okay, thank you so much. Yes. Maria, you want to say something to your, thank to you. your viewers? Thank you. Know. Um, <laughs> uh, anyways, um, thank you guys for... Um, watching this show, I really had fun. I hope you guys had fun also. And um, um, I know this is really a hard time for all of us, but let's stay strong. And I hope to see you guys very, very soon. Yes, mahal thank you. Kayo. Yes, mahal ka rin namin, Maria. Thank you so mahal much. Kayo. <laughs> yes, okay. Thank you, Maria. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Bye. 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 Ayan, ladies and gentlemen, Miss Marie Ozawa Street.
live from Japan. Thank you so much. No, kahit busy busy siya, no, nag-run siya ng, ng bar niya dyan sa Shinjuku, no, eh, nabigyan niya tayo ng pagkakataon na na makasalamuha siya no and and gusto ko magpasalamat pala sa mga kaibigan no si Mr. Nelson Canlas yan no talagang walang sawang nagpapa-watch party ng OO na no para maraming maka makapanood niyan thank you Mr. Nelson Canlas si MJ Marfori syempre ang aking guest coordinator at uh, taga-watch party din niya no ay pasensya na kung, kung yung mga groups niyo ini-invade niya <laughs> niyayaya niya sa watch party no <laughs> Ayan, ay sobrang to the support naman. Thank you so much, MJ. No? Tsaka sa lahat ng mga nanonood sa atin, si Bernadette Reyes pala, Kapuso Bernadette Reyes, happy, happy birthday sa sa'yo, no? Happy birthday, enjoy your special day. Kapamilya, kumpare ko, Dolan Castro, happy, happy birthday. Ayan, I hope you're having a great time, no? Enjoy mo lang ang araw mo, bro. And happy, happy birthday. Okay, sa mga hindi natin nabasa, okay? Ayan, sabi ni Stella, kaya biyab, thank you for welcoming again. Oh, oh, yan. O yun, Nelson Canlas, do you also shop in Don Quixote, our favorite store in Japan? Well, yes, Nelson, no? Basta nandun ako. <laughs> <laughs> Sayang hindi natin natanong kay, kay ano. Pero alam ko, ikaw, adik ka dyan sa Don Quixote. Ay, mahilig mamili. <laughs> Ayan. Ayan, sabi ni Jun Dutero, Dicatoria, hi, Nelson. Tapos si Melvin Tan, hi, Sir Oscar. Tapos sabi ni May, MJ Maria, how do you feel like you were the number one trending topic during the tsunami? Everyone was concerned and they were looking for you. Totoo yan. Yan, natanong natin yan kanina, MJ, no? Tapos sabi ni Ian Gonzalez, good evening, OO, your friend Ian from Open Tambayan. Pretty pa din ni Maria. Yan. Thank you, Ian. Oo nga pala yung mga nanonood sa atin dyan sa UPLB Open Tambayan. Maraming maraming salamat po, ano? Tapos yan, si... Sino pa ba? Maraming mga tanong kay Maria. Sayang hindi natin nabasa lahat. No? Edward, Gula, Minyong. Hi, Maria Ozawa. Salamat. Na-enjoy ko ang kabataan ko dahil sa iyo. Yes. Sana maganda yung ano, no? memories ng kabataan. I'm sure. I'm sure. Si, si Maria nga, eh, nagpapaalala sa iyo na maganda yung kabataan. So, ayan. So, si Jason Chaser. Gandang gabi, mga kausap. Ang ganda. Ang ganda ng kausap natin tonight. Paswat naman, Maria Ozawa. Sayang, Jason, hindi umabot. No? Kasi busy rin si Maria. Kailangan niyang uh, may gawin. Kaya kailangan niyang kumalas agad. No? Pero thank you guys no, sa pag-stick with us. Sa uh, uuna no, at sa panood. Tapos si Jeline Molino and Jonathan De La Rosa. Shoutout siguro yan. Sabi ni, sabi ni Ramil. Uy! Ramil from Australia. Ramil Bautista. Hello. Nakuya si Ramil. Classmate ko yan. Number one pa ni Maria Ozawa yan. <laughs> Ramil ano, di ba? Uh, nanong balik ba yung mga, yung, ano mo, yung mga childhood memories mo? Di ba? Dahil kay Maria. O oh, yan. Sabi ni Nelson, uh, sabi ni MJ Marfori, Nelson Canlas, Lodi ka. Wow. Sabi ni Nelson Canlas, mag-shoutout naman, Idol Oscar Oida. Wow, mas idol kita, Mr. Nelson Canlas. <laughs> yeah. And thank you for watching, Nelson. Ah, talaga, thank you, thank you sa support. Ano. Si Corchus Gonzaga, pa-shoutout. Lods, yes, Corchus, good evening. Tapos sabi ni, ito pa isa pa itong fan ni Maria Ozawa. John Jess Anthony Bustamante, pa-shoutout. Si Miko, Jason, at Jess. Ayan, nag-roll call na mga Maria Ozawa Forever Fans Club <laughs> ng UP Los Banos Chapter 1. Ayan, sila Jess, Anthony, si Jason, at si Nico. Ayan, mga Maria Ozawa Forever yan. Ayan, si Ramil Bautista, hello from Sydney. Yes, hello Ramil, we miss you. Si Edward Gula Minyong, yeah, nabasa yung comment ko. T.Y. Sir Oscar, nako, thank you rin Edward no, sa pag-comment. Malaking bagay yan. Salamat sa suporta nyo. Si Pai Bora Caps, laging ayos ang kwentuhan with Sir O. Ayos! Thank you so much. Thank you so much, Pai. Oh, ito si oh, Ron K. Ako, ito kaibigan kong metal. Hindi ko naabutan si Maria. Nako, sayang naman, Ronald. Pero may, mamaya, after ng show, no, pwede mo i-playback to. Sayang, di mo naabutan. Pero thank you for watching, Ronald. No, nabati mo na ba si Paring Dolan? Birthday niya ngayon. Yes. <coughs> Tapos sabi ni Anthony Millar, o oh, isa pa ito si Anthony Millar, talagang ano rin to, fan din to ni, ni Maria Ozawa. Kamusta Anthony? 
Jamming tayo minsan, magaling kumanta yan si Anthony Millar. <laughs> si Gerald, uy, oh, ito, pa-shoutout naman, Kuya Oka. Pa, hi, KMJ. Thank you, Gerald, mga karating, no, mga karating. Gerald, uy, kulig po yan. Uh, kumusta na? <clears throat> si June Bretero, Dicatorian, Nelson, my third favorite reporter. Wow! Ayan. Ayan. Si Cortius Gonzaga, love watching OO. Thank you, thank you so much, uh, Celine Marie, no? Tapos, Si Anthony Hener, naku Anthony, nahuli ka naman. Nakakaka nakaalis na busy kasi. Pero after nito, ipanoorin mo yung playback. Mamaya i-watch party natin, no. So yung mga medyo na late ng dating, kung gusto niyo lang naman, no, ginagawa ko si after ng live minsan, pag may pagkakataon, pag hindi pa ako tinatawag ni MJ, <laughs> at di pa ako pinag-aalaga ng bata, <laughs> nakakapag-watch party ako let. So abangan niyan, just in case, no. Okay si Si Gerald, uy, paas, kamusta yung incident na pinicture ng private info niya sa immigration? Naku, sayang, Gerald, di ko na tanong yan, no? Okay, ang taalas talagang reporter na ito si Gerald, uy. Eh. Si Cortius Gonzalez, si Miss Mab po ulit. O, oh, hatakin natin yan si Mab, no? Busy din yan, pero, pero yan si Mab, good friend naman yan. So, why not, no? I'm sure, papayag naman someday ulit. Si Romulo, from Sydney rin to, Goko Palace. Si Oo talaga, habol ko panoorin, may Ozawa man o wala. Wow naman. Thank you talaga, Romulo Mulong, no? Talagang brad ko yan eh sa UPLB. Thank you, Mulong, at nandyan ka lagi watching, no? Sana hindi ka magsawa, no? Nandyan ka lang, pag nandyan ka, shoutout ka lang, no? Shoutout ka namin. <laughs> okay. Si Anthony Millar, good job, Oo na. Thank you, Anthony, no? Sana, sana, Anthony, no? Alang-alang sa inyo ni John Linaw. Sana someday mag-guest natin si Carmina Villaruel. <laughs> yan, crush na crush ni, ni Anthony Millal at ni John Lino nung pang grade school kami. Yan. Si ano, si si Oliver Pulido, more, uy, kasama ako sa Taekwondo to. Taekwondo champion Oliver Pulido. More viewers, oh, oh, thank you so much. Tapos si June Gretario. Siyempre, June, thank you. Ah. Lagi ka nandyan. Lagi talaga ako nagmamadali kapag oh, oh, na. Yes! Guys, thank you, thank you so much for watching. No, nakakatouch yung, uh, walang katapusan yung pagsuporta. Ayan. Naku, si Sir Robert Tan. Sir Robert Tan, oo na. Thank you so much. Kamusta, Robert? Sir Robert, kamusta ang Blade, no? Sana makadalo kami dyan soon. And uh, si Melvin Tan, sino po ang next guest nyo? Ayun, no? oo. Siyempre, meron tayong bukas. May bukas ulit, no? Magsama-sama tayo. Dahil eto feeling ko talagang... Uh, mag enjoy kay bukas dahil promise, eh, jamingan na naman to, friend. Jamingan to. Kaya huwag kayo mawawala, no? Huwag kayo mawawala dahil uh, <clears throat> special guest ang, ang ano natin bukas. Ang guests natin. At, uh, pero bago yan, no? Bago, bago ko banggitin yung special guest natin bukas, basa muna ako let si si Cortius Gonzaga, dear Cap Kaputian, galit ka ba sa akin? Ha, <laughs> ano ba yung kaputian? Ano yun? <laughs> Ayan, pwede ka na Eh, o si Sir Edley O pwede ka na model ng Edley Designs Ako ba yon Sir Edley O si Marie Ozawa? <laughs> Ito kasi si Sir Edley Kilala ko itong Ito yung gumagawa ng mga, no, ng mga high quality Ng mga jersey, bike jersey no? Talagang, talagang pag nagbibisikleta kami niyan Noon Sikat kami, tsaka magkomportable pag ang suot namin, eh, Edley Designs, no, na bicycle jersey, no. So, so Sir Edley, kamusta? Sana, no, makapag-bike tayo ulit someday, no. I'm sure ikaw, ikaw, nagbabike ka pa rin, no. For sure, nagbabike ka pa rin. Sana makasama kami sa'yo someday, no. Um, Ingat-ingat sa mag-bike, no. Tapos, sabi naman ni Mel Bintan, kantahan na. na <laughs> eh, sino pa kakantayin natin ngayon? <laughs> Ayun no. Si ano si si MJ atake natin para kumanta. <laughs> Ayun no. Tapos ito pa si ano. Sabi ni Edward Gulam Minyong hashtag #oo na bukas abangan ang guest. O ito nga eh. Na, nagkakaroon ako ng problema eh papakita ko sana sa inyo yung guest ko bukas eh. May idea na ba kayo? May idea na ba kayo kung sino? Ha? Hindi ko ma Hindi ko ma transport transport to. Teka lang ah. Ah, kaya 
Oo, oh, di bali, di bali. Di bali, di bali. Basta bukas sa manyo ko ulit, promise. Andiyan pa ba kay bukas? Ha? Oo, ito nga tinatry ko ng ano eh, i-surprise sila sa pag-play ng, uh, ng plug para sa mga guest ko bukas. Pero, apparently hindi ko ma- ma-transfer. Pero, pinost ko yata yan sa ano, pinost ko yan sa, sa Facebook, sa Instagram ko. So, bukas, abangan nyo, no, ang uh, guest natin, MYMP, no, nagbabalik sila para isa na namang uh, Friday night jamming, no. For sure, masaya yan. We will be playing yung mga favorite MYMP songs nyo. Plus, pwede mag-request, no? So, kung, kung may mga gusto ko yung kanta, gusto nyo yung pakinggan over Friday night, no? Pang relax, no? Weekender, i-type nyo po yan sa comment section at uh, para mapagandaan ng MYMP. So, kasama natin bukas si Chin, saka si Carmela, no? At the rest of the band para sa Friday jamming yan. So, thank you so much. Si Pybor, ha, Cups? Yes, Miss MJ, please join ka pag jamming na. Okay. <laughs> Ayan. 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 Sabi niya, baka daw sumuho kayo pag narindi ko manta si MJ. O, sabi ni Melvin Tan, wow! Sabi ni Coaches Gonzaga, wag na pong matulog. Wag matulog ka para bukas ni energy. Yan, M. Melvin Tan, MYMP. Yes, totoo, MYMP, no? So, bukas po yan, no? mga kausap, no? abangan po niyo yan. Yes, June! O, oh, June! Oo, oh, basta ikaw, Oscar, thank you. June, ready mo na yung vocal cords mo, ha? Sabi ko sa MYMP, andyan ka, di sila pwedeng mapahiya sa iyo. <laughs> si Melvin Tan, thank you, Sir Oscar. Thank you sa inyo, guys. Thank you sa inyo dahil sa walang sawa niyong pagsusuporta sa, sa OO na. No? At uh, pipilitin natin, no? sa abot ng ating mga kaya, eh araw-araw, Hanggat kaya, no, mag-imbita ng mga guests para nga, eh, kahit pa paano magta- matanggal, pantanggal stress, no, so sa araw-araw natin. Kung may... Good good day ba ngayon? Good day? Parang konti lang ang, ano, ang reported deaths, no? Wala yata, zero yata today. Kung totoo yan, good news. Ang ano, oo, pero sana pag-pray, pag-pray natin, ano, na kumonti ang mga bilang ng mga, ng mga nagkakasakit. Kaya let's all do our part, no, na, na mag-ingat, no? Uh, Mag, mag-ingat tayo, no? Mag-ingat tayo, wear mask, practice social distancing. If, if ano, if uh, hanggat maaari, stay home, no? Stay safe. Ay, baby, Erin naman, ginagalaw mo yung studio ko, yun, no? Ako naman, nagulo tuloy yung mga ilaw-ilaw ko. Nako, sorry. <laughs> sorry. Sorry naman, sorry naman, no? Si Erin yun, kita mo, na, nahulog yung mga lights ko. <laughs> oh, anyway, guys, See you tomorrow, no? Huwag po kayo mawala dahil kasama natin MYMP. So, so stay home, stay safe, mga, mga kapuso, and God bless. God bless! Ingat! Kitakits bukas! Oo na! With Oscar Oida. Magandang gabi mga kausap. Oras naman para sa OO na. <laughs> Talagang background music kita, Ewan. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Isang oras na kwelang kwentuhan at kaalaman. Huwag yun ako masyadong intindihin ang mga nawala. Dahil lang mag-alala. Napaka-OO lang, chumamba lang. Usapang anything under the mood. MG Marfori. Pogi, Pogi. Mas guwapo ka, bro. Isa lang ang sagot namin dyan. Ano? Oh, Hindi ko mas maganda si MJ. Siyempre! Siyempre! <laughs> <laughs> Oo, oh, ako dito. <laughs> Pero may baon ka ba sa aming joke or kanta? Sabi niya ako nag-prepare! Surprise! Say na rin na rin kiss me kahit anong aking gawin. No, you... You look great Gabi Gabi sa kanyang FB page. Heto na siya, mga kausap. I can feel it. Love you. Oo na, with Oscar Oida.